guys welcome to my youtube channel i am your baby girl as you can see christina Re, and this is my youtube channel okay guys make sure subscribe like share and comment so in today's video guys i have a big problem actually it's a face camera and if you story so the problem the problem is kuna uh, time ni mekuana my friend last year not last year we have been in a relationship with this guy for two years na sisemi ni mwaka gani na msiniulize my body count because body count always remains two yule boy wa high school na boy yule patana na Nairobi that is it the rest are history so this guy when we met we met in august the first actually ilikuwa um, girlfriend's day na nilikuwa natoka church then when we met with this guy took a vibe alikuwa he was driving by the way he was driving akaniambia hey i'm super nikubebe nikasema no sienti mbali ni hapa tu mbele akasema okay umekata nikubebe so can you give me my number can you give me your number oh sorry guys kizungu so si mimi nikampa number jamaa akaenda basi kumbe alikuwa anapita kwetu nikamwona akapita kwa gate mimi nikatembea nikafika home reason why i didn't ingia kwa gari yake juu mimi sipalangi gari ya strangers i don't hata kama sina fare mimi waomba lift kwa matatu siwezi ama ni request uba then nifike home walipe but ingiangi kwa gari ya strangers so mimi nikafika home tukaanza kuchat na huyu jamaa obvious tukapendana na ukiangalia huyu jamaa wangu he sura alibarikiwa kwanza sura tunatumia yake achana na hii yangu yangu tuweke kando sura tunatumia yake na tukipata watoto nilikuwa na, nataka like tukipata na hii watoto to make sure mtoto anatumia sura yake yani kijana wa mtu alibarikiwa yeah he's so handsome he's so cute mungu alimpa love so boy he gonna enjoy come so kijana alikuwa mzuri sana nikajua kwao in fact kumbe kwao si mbali okay anaishi bado na wasasi wake kwao si mbali just around here na si kwa hiyo like kunaweza kuwa na kijana handsome around here but kwenda kwao lazima like kuna ile njia kwenda kwa barabara hakuna hakuna shortcut so tukajuana tuka tukajuana for 4 months and then nikaanza kwenda kwao So alikuwa na ni request naenda kwao. Nikienda kwao like we just watch drink tunakunywa kwanza soda juice tuna chill tu hapo kwa coach tuki watch. Eh sasa sandari. Kwa nini nimekuja kufanya? Sometimes like we gadol hivyo tu. And then naenda. Nikaendelea tu like eh ama jamaa na kufikiria ama wajir. <laughs> sasa na niokopa. Kimoya moyo bro mini bro bro Sura ruwe like kimoya moyo rarua Tukaendelea hivyo for like four times and then kuna siku akaanza kuongelea about sex yani tukichat tu eh akaniuliza kama nishawaifanya nikamwambia yes nishawaifanya Remember guys nimewaambia huyu jamani nilikuwa nimemnoki like sura eh sura tunatumia yake like ni kwani mpenda yango yote so kama be yes nishawaifanya juu yani nilikuwa nimempenda so akaniambia okay next time tutajaribu hii kitu nikamwambia oh mbona mbona unakuanga like skirt you don't want to do it jamaa akaniambia anakuanga skirt because unaka uko na weight it mean uko na weight kumshinda although baada ya anakuanga like naweza kabeba <laughs> I'm sorry if you are watching this I'm not going to mention your name and I'm really sorry but let me say it ju like imekuwa kiniumiza na nimekuwa na features jai ambia mtu yote even my close friends wana watch na sijai waambia I'm really sorry but you guys say ni usiku so the light ina nisumbua so the guy tukapanga like we will do it siku ikafika nikaenda kwao nikaingia si tukaanza like hizo tu magadoling tuka watch netflix eh hadi mimi na boyeka like tu watch netflix for more than two hours two hours 
tukapo tu mama yake akojo na huyu mtu he's not young by the way he is he is he was he was 27 years so he's called i think 29 haja but anisho kama mama ako 29 years imagine we were dating for we dated for 2 years yes so si time ikafika ya kwenda bed tuka mbu 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 tukafika bed tukatoa nguo hey sasa sema sema si mr dickson munene akafungua macho obvious nikafanya job yangu nikafanya bj vizuri akapenda <laughs> guys at this moment i don't know how to face the camera <laughs> because the story is <laughs> so okay dickson munene akafungua macho guys okay sorry guys i'm not going to say direct to the point because my friends ni watoto i think they are nine years wana watch this video so i'm not going to say direct to the point but mtaelewa who is dickson munene so dickson munene akafungua macho anatafuta um, sasa hiyo time si mimi niko okay tulikuwa ni nini kifo cha mende mimi niko chini ako juu dickson munene amefungua macho sasa miss kanyau ako ako ready kusalimia dickson sasa dickson anakuja hapati dickson anatafuta hapati like eh mimi nikaanza kushindwa nimsaidie kupeleka miss kanyau ama niachane sasa okay let me say this is miss kanyau This is Miss Kanyau. So Miss Munene ako si akapa anatafuta hivi. Na here is the Kanyau. Sasa hawezi <laughs> Hawezi shikanisha. Eh, so niko Kwani huyu ni hajawai ama ama anachifanya? Mimi ai nikaendelea to like. Eh. So najua hiyo like Miss Kanyau kanatoa kanatoa machozi. Like kanataka Munene I like Mnaelewa anze. Wa, tukaendelea. Tukasumbua na for like 5 minutes sana. Alafu Dickson akafunga macho. Hey. Remember nilikuwa nime BJ amefungua macho. Ikabidi tena niamuke ni mbj afungue macho. So, after ku BJ akafungua macho, nikamwambia yeye ata ataenda. Mimi ni kue, alafu nikafanya aje nika drive. Hey, that is getting hot. So, si akaenda chini mimi nikakuwa juu niki drive. We, mimi nikapeleka. Sasa si mimi okay juu niliona ameshindwa kupata kanyau. Sasa venye nilienda juu, mimi nikachukua Dickson munene nikakuwa kanyau hivi. Hmm connected. Sitoka endelea. Si mimi nikaanza kufanya kazi yangu venye na jua, venye inavaa, venye naelewa, venye nataka pia aski, askie. Tukaendelea. Bu, bu, bu. Yaani like tukaendelea nikaanza kuona he, hata misikanya huu, tumachozi tunatoka sasa kwa wingi hivi. Alafu nikamsikia anasema pia yeye tumachozi tunatoka. Basi kuna sound alitoa. Et saka kusema hiyo sound but you know he came ali come ali mwaka ali mwaka machozi pia msikanyao ali come sasa in the moment it's me like it's normal like when a man aki come kuna hiyo sound ni normal but i'm not kidding me ni mtoto hey ni mtoto okay forget about it stuka endelea like sasa si tume nini tume come ni time ya relax Jama wangu akalala hivi. Nikaona tu like akilala, mimi nikafikiria like amechoka. So, nikaamka pole pole, nikafanya whatever I did, nikampia nikamsaidia kumfanyia hizo whatever. Nikatupa kwa dustbin, alafu nikakuja nikala, nikalala. Sikusikia jamaa ki breathe. Nikamshia, nikamuitana. Nikamuita jina anaitwa Let me call him Dickson Munene. Yeah. 
Jio ni jina tumeanzia juni. Nikamwambia dig dig some name. Dig some name. Dig some name. Hai tiki. Kumbe jamaa wangu alifaint. Dickson alifaint wakati alikam. Dickson munene anataka kwenda mbinguni. Guys. Sasa mimi nikashindwa ndafanya nje nikaanza kupanic. Ushawahi uko kwa niko kwao niko kwa nyumba yao ya mamake na babake but si ni like ako na room yake ni nyumba okay for those who don't understand uko ni kwao walijenga walinunua Nairobi wakajenga so the house is so big so tulikuwa na anti alikuwa uko hata kwa anajua kuna msichana kwa hii nyumba mimi nikashindwa ni Titana aje nikafanya like nikaanza kumpuliza hewa tukakaa for more than 5 minutes Jamani kaona anafungua tomato hivi. Anafanya hivi. Nikamshika. Nikatoka nikaenda kumtafutia maji ya kunywa nikamletea maji. Then nikaenda like kitchen. Hata sikuwa najua kitchen iko wapi mimi nilikuwa nafuata tu. Nikapata kitchen nikamletea food. Nili make nili try to make indomie. Indomie is just 5 minutes. Nikamletea akakula. So, nikamuliza what happened. Jamaa kaniambia hajawahi fanya it was his first time na and he was so shocked Nikamwambia na ulikuwa na joke na shida akasema yes Time wanga anajaribu kushika mangi anyonge mangi apeleke mangi mahakamani hiyo kitu wanga ina mahapenia mostly wanga anafanya akiwa na mabeshto yake then his best friends wana try kum help wanajua wenye wanga wanamfanyia anaamuka na mimi you know he didn't tell me from the start anakuanga na shida like akikam kuna kuanga na shida so ndio nika realize it time yote amekuwa akiniheba tusifanye nikamwambia but ungeniambia atungefanya akasema like alikuwa anaokopa angeona ni kama ningemchezea ama like guys niliokopa so akaniambia but kuna dawa huwa anatumia na hiyo siku alikuwa amesahau kutumia ndio aka faint so nikamwambia next time nikikuja utatumia dawa ndio use faint akasema sawa remember guys mimi niko na wait <laughs> so nilikuwa nimemkalia nikaona ni kama eh nimekaumiza okay so guys the story short is nilikuja home nikamwacha akiwa tu sawa hata kunisindikiza you know niliokopa like tunaweza fika the stay as anguke mimi nikakuja home tena tukapanga after one month tukapanga tena turudie hiyo kitu obvious tena tukaenda na hapo alikuwa amejua pali Mrs. Kanyao wako so venye alikuwa juu akokuwa anapeleka venye nafaa kumbe hajui Alibarikiwa na Dickson mnene ako sawa lakini shida ni hajili pale Miss Kanyau wako so si ako juu akaingia Insisi si aku pin 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 ako tu Si kwa nasikia like aki move mimi nikamwambia okay let me come nifanye yale mambo tena akasema sawa juu yani eh Miss Kanyau hatari Si mimi nikafanya ile kitu after kumaliza the same same thing happen jamaa wangu alifanya ha, 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 ha. akalala aka faint tena tukalala 10 minutes jamaa kamuka <laughs> aki dickson umenitesa umenitesa so jamaa wangu kuamka wa tena nilipanic kwanza nilikuwa nataka lakini like, nitoke but i came to realize that nikitoka obviously kwa gate waliniona nikiingia na security wanataka like ukitoka kwa nyumba mtu asimame kwa balcony ama utoke na mwenye nyumba au waone tu kitoka ndio waseme like hakuna kitu umechukua kwa hiyo nyumba most securities wanapenda kufanya hivyo so ikabidi nifumilie amuke tena ni nimtafutie kitu kitchen akule yani watoto wa with a big i think this guy ni mtu wa with a big then What thing I came to realize with this guy is that maybe alikuwa anafungwa pambas sana. Listen mummies, 
wale wa mama size mko na watoto wadogo you know wangu ni mkubwa that's why i feel regal i'm a mother of 10 year old boy <laughs> so how watoto wanafungua pambas mna waletea shida by the way kumba asifunga mtoto for some time then umtoe asika inayo sana hiyo mkojo inamuumiza sana so this guy i came to realize that alikuwa anafungua pambas sana hadi nilimwambia aulize mama yake akauliza mama yake akasema alikuwa anafungua pambas for long long time that's why mr dixon mnene anatusumbua so mimi naomba sasa tena huyu jamani mtu wa witabix indomi mimi ni mtu wa ugali <laughs> mimi ni mtu wa chapati mimi ni mtu wa kideri like ndio maana niko na so mimi ni kaboy gatu na yeye nikamwambia okay tutajaribu next time tuone but sitaki tena kurudi huko sasa tumeishi tumeishi for more than 8 months bila kwenda kwao but we talk we talk on the phone like tuna chat vizuri tu hajui kama sitaki kurudi huko tena mimi sitaki watch if nikirudi huko for the last time kumbe ni siku yake ya kwenda mbinguni msikie Christina ameshikwa what will happen yaani ujue ni mtoto wa mtu na anatekemewa na wazazi wake alafu niende huko tufanye aende mbinguni ikuwe mwisho wake kwa hii dunia mimi ndafanya je alafu nishikwe na pia mimi niko na mamangu ananitekemea so nilimwambia tu tutapanga tutapanga but just a day night ndio nimemwambia ukweli nimemwambia sitaki kukuja na sitaki kuendelea na wewe utaniletea mashida right now i think ni limuleta depression jamaa wangu napikiwa simu na mama yake jamaa hakuli jamaa analia eti anataka kujiua so mama yake baadaye ame ameniongelesha kwa simu akasema just come talk to him ni nini mnafanya na mimi nilikuwa najua nini marafiki mbona una like mnamtreat mimi nikashindwa eh mimi sijamwambia kwa ubaya but nilimwambia hatutakuwa pamoja tena nile tu naokopa ni bila sijamia mama yake what happened and i'm really shy naokopa kumwambia it's hard by the way hata ni ngumu kumake video it's hard for me hmm? uko na mtu bet and then afraid for 10 minutes utafanyaje mimi sijui kuhudumia mtu akifaint sijui so yani sometimes nafikiri eh sasa size anataka kujiua size analia mama message ndio hizi amenitumia okay mimi na reply na mwambie tunakupenda na kupenda but sikuji kwako period sasa okay najua mnataka niende but nikienda tutafanya nini na akisema tufanye kutakutaenda aje hmm? alafu mami please hiyo hiyo maneno ya kufunga watoto wenu pambas achaneni nayo funga for some time si long long time mnatuharibia mabwana ona sasa huyu wangu and he's not young 29 years 29 years hmm? mnafikiria ni mtoto mnafikiria na joke na mtoto what if akufe sai mimi sitaki kwenda kwao tena so that is it so guys kama ushawaiona mtu akona shida kama hii comment down below ni mfanyie nini niendelee ama ni mwache na nimwambie nini ndio as just trace for now i go in a in a very bad way at a gender job for two weeks like na ni mtu ana work vizuri eh hey, anafanya job mzu eh hey, ako na job sura ali sasa huyu anaweza salisha kweli sura nayo mungu alimpea sura kama ya babake sije ni mninganishe na sura mtoto mweupe toto hansa Total Wow. Model. Wow. Same for the same ref guy. It's hot. So guys, comment down below what do you think of this comment? Evo. Eh, what do you think in this video with this story? Thank you guys for watching. Make sure subscribe, like, comment and share. Remember to comment by then comments na nataka nitafanya nini huyu mtu. Thank you. Bye bye.